Welcome back my children to another Pokemon opening video. Today I will be opening a Dragonite V box. That's what it's called. So it includes one full promo card featuring Dragonite V. And it's the jumbo version and the tiny version, the regular version of course. Let's see. First let's check the, the sides. There's the left side, then the right side, the top the bottom and then there's the back so I got this from TJ Maxx for $15.99 a while back I don't remember when, when potentially like a year or two years ago but anyways um Dra Dragonite V box lead the dragon wait what yeah lead the dragon types to victory with Dragonite V Dragonite V is an intent intelligent and powerful powerful Pokemon capable of circling the globe in less than a day. Trainers rarely see this Pokemon, and few are lucky enough to catch one. Now this sought after Dragon type can stand beside you with the Dragon Knight V box. You'll get the fierce but kind-hearted Dragonite V in both playable and display sizes, as well as extra goodies from Pokemon TCG booster packs. So the Pokemon TCG Dragonite V box includes one foil promo card featuring Dragonite V, one foil oversized card featuring Dragonite V, yeah we already know that, four Pokemon TCG booster packs and a code card for the Pokemon trading card game online. And there's the rest of the stuff, there's the Pokemon Company International thing, this thing, whatever it says there. Okay, it shows the, I think the booster packs, I'm not gonna read it. Then there's uh, that, the barcode, if you guys want to scan it for whatever reason, the um, this website thing, and that is it. Also, I'm using a new playmat that I got from, what was it, Ali, AliExpress, yeah, AliExpress, and I liked it, I, I loved it, it's like, it, usually, normally it's a picture of a poker table with dogs if I remember correctly but I got the Pokemon version it looks so badass I love it, it has Meowth Mew Teddy Ursa uh Osul Us Osurel no I, that's the baby version so Osurel maybe oh, I think it's Merrell and this is Os Osul Osul I forgot the name to be honest Pikachu Rylou and Psyduck very confused with a queen and a jack, no wait, king and queen. But anyways, just want to show the mat. I will be using this uh, regularly, but I do have another different uh, Pokemon mat, of course, just so it won't get boring. But anyways, I'm gonna start with the box now. There we go. There's that. I think it's now empty. You can see my finger from there. I'll throw it down the floor. All right, now to open this. Wait, how do I? Why? Okay, there we go. I knew there was something wrong. I was doing something wrong. Okay. How do I? Does it have? Oh, it does have the little thing here. Cool. And there, very nicely came off from the little thing where it was at inside. So there's the small version, Dragonite V with Shred and Dragon Gale. There's the regular sized version, of course. I'll leave that right here. Wait, actually, let me get rid of the plastic quickly. I'll put it in the trash quickly. All right, so put it right there. Then there's the big version. You can see it, uh, here's the, both of them together for scale. Wow, it's like literally four of them together. But yeah, there is the the mother and the kid, if you will. Then there's the packs. So one is uh, chilling rain, rain or rain, rain right. Then there's vivid voltage, evolving skies and uh, Fusion Strike. All of them from Sword and Shield. And there is the code for the whole box. Let me see. 
Here's the code for you guys. We'll put that there. Let me take this away. And now for the pack. So let me see, which one should I start off with? Which one do I like better? Um, I'll do Fusion Strike first. So let's see. I do want to save the pack, so I'm going to try to open it nicely so that it does again ruined or, you know, ripped. I like collecting the packs, especially Pokemon since it has a, they usually all have different designs for like four different or five different designs for each booster pack. So yeah. Okay, let me just operate. Because the hard part from doing this, I have to like slowly take them out, not mess them up. There we go. So it came out actually very nice. Yeah, very nice. Anyways, I'll leave it right here. There's the code for you guys. I'll put it over there. So now for the card trick, I kind of don't remember. I think it might be these two. I'll put these three just in case. I'll try to remember. Anyways, first there is Snom, the uh, little warm Pokemon. It's a, I think it's a clay version, or is it like, it kind of looks like a gummy. Makes me want to eat it. Probably delicious. Probably blueberry flavor, and this will be like vanilla or something like that. Find Ice is a, its attack. And then there's Onyx. Also, they should make a Crystal Onyx card have they ever made one i'm not quite sure to be honest but there's a guard press and rock throw for onyx and there's jigglypuff kind of looks like a ball it makes me want to kick her and there's a she has pound and let's all roll out that's very fitting for how how much of a ball she looks like or a balloon i guess you do want to ki uh, kick a balloon as well and then there's Durant, the Iron Ant Pokemon, as uh, ad. I thought I said um, University, but it's Adver Adversity Jaws for its attack. And there's a, ooh, a Psychic Energy, yeah, very special. And there's Eldegoss. I just really want to blow on it, like, because of the, the thing it's supposed to be. You know those what are they called dandelions i think the little like it has a stem and it has the little white thing kind of like kind of looks looks like this and you just blow on it and then the little pieces come off that's what it reminds me of i think that's what it's supposed to be i'm not quite sure anyways it has sunny wind and there's power tablets oh that actually looks cool i would definitely eat some candy like that they do look pretty tasty. That's pro probably is lemon flavor. This one is like blueberry flavor or so. And this one is probably like raspberry or cherry flavor. There's a um, item trainer. And then there's beware. The uh, big bear Pokemon that apparently kills you. It has split spiral punch and a strength because it has a lot of strength apparently then there's Panseer, the fire monkey pokemon as a surprise attack these are one of the pokemon uh, i mean they grew on me a little bit they're kind of cute but i still don't like them the uh, three monkeys i don't know i just don't like them that much then there's a uh, nine tails the fire pokemon the Pokemon that Brock should have kept. If I remember, he let her go, right? He, um, oh, he, he gave her back to the original owner, if I remember correctly. But, um, it was a cool Pokemon for Brock to have. But anyway, anyways, it has supernatural flames. Then the last card. Oh, I did it right. So it's the fifth and sixth from the from the back i think whatever it's arcanine and yeah this is the rare evolves from growlithe it has fire claws and heat tackle i like arcanine apparently i've heard that he was um i think he was intended to be a legendary or he just 
kind of like a legendary I'm not quite sure one of those anyways um i'll continue with vivid voltage i like this pokemon he's pretty cool some people don't apparently okay i'm gonna open it nicely once again okay not bad oh it came out nice okay now to take them out okay much smoother for sure whoa gotta be careful almost dropped them there's the code put it right there so if i remember how did i do it again it's either yeah i think it's like this actually let me do it again three to the back whatever all right there's shatot the little musical note pokemon his head looks like a musical note it, uh, it has Miner, Aaron, Running, and Peck. Oh, they use him as like a little, uh, what's it called? Delivery bird. The birds that deliver stuff and whatnot. Anyways, uh, Clobopus. <laughs> Funny sounding name, Clobo Clobopus, if you know what I mean. It's a tantrum Pokemon. Um, it's more like an octopus, no? It has beat and hammer in. Then there's Skittle, the greatest of all time. Little goat, it has synthesis and razor leaf. He's, why is he sitting like a cat? That's not what you're supposed to do. You're a goat, you're supposed to stand on cliffs and not sit like a dog, uh, I mean like a cat, like a bread. Anyways, there's Shuppet, the ghost Pokemon. It has Haunt, he will haunt you in your sleep. And make sure you don't breathe like ever again then there's a uh, still energy then there oh okay I gotta be careful then there's a uh, cramorant um deep throating <laughs> this fish looks very wrong but uh looks right at the same time the gulp pokemon oh yeah for that's for sure a gulp pokemon Anyways, uh, has continuous gulp miss missile. It gulps down the ammo and then shoots it out, if you know what I mean. Anyways, then there's um, Nessa. I always thought uh, they gave her very short clothing for some reason. But yeah, essentially she's supposed to be like under 18, 18 I think. Or well, whatever. There's a who is that a Pokemon right here in the back? It's kind of hard to tell. But yeah, there she is, the Nessa, potentially worth a bit. I'm not quite sure, just because she's a, a girl. Then there's a Nuss Leaf. He has uh, some very thick legs, and he has Razor Leaf. Pretty cool artwork. He evolves from C dot. All right, then there's a ferro seed, a seed that looks like an egg and has green spikes and looks pretty cool and has an ice as well and has reaction. Um, not sure what he's reacting to. Probably has a reaction channel. So yeah, you know, there's Taylor. Oh, he's like a little clay model. Cool. And he has a double pack. That's a nice card, reverse rare. Then the last card, let's see, anything nice? There is Metagross, an iron leg, iron leg Pokemon. He looks very buff there. He looks like he could crush you and crush you into pieces, of course. As ability, levitation, field, and leg quick as an attack, because he has those buff legs, of course. All right, that is it for now. And now for the next pack. Hmm, which one do I like? I like the color of the pack for this one. I like purplish and bluish. Ch chilling Rain, but I think Evolving Skies is a better pack, according to some people. But I'll do Evolving Skies first, just because I like the, the, the color of that pack. Now I will be opening it. Oh my goodness, I messed it up. Whatever. I was trying to open it nicely, but it did not work out. Anyways, 
here's the code for you guys. Now, if I remember, yeah, it has to be these two, if I remember correctly. It's been like that for the, because this one is the rare, right? Yeah, it's the rare, okay. Anyways, there's Psyduck. Is he a clay model? No, he's not. He just uh, kind of like paint brushed, maybe. He has rain splash. He's very confused. And does not know his name at all. Probably thinks he's Meowth. Wouldn't be surprised. Then there's Swablu, the cotton bird Pokemon. He has surprise attack, or she, potentially. Anyways, uh, then there's C Dot, the one to he evolves to not sleeve. And he's a, a nut, acorn, <laughs> I, which is a nut as well, right? It's an acorn walking. I would like to see an actual acorn walking, to be honest. He has a, Astonish. And there's Woobat. Not to be confused with Subat. He is the OG, the Subat. Woobat is the the one who wants to be a Subat. He has Collect and no. No, no, no. And there's Eevee. Oh, and there's a request on the in the background that she's I think looking up to. But then again, it kind of looks like she's looking this direction instead of here. That's what it looks like. But there is a request. Very, very cool. It has V Search and Stampede. Awesome. That's a nice artwork. I like this one. Anyways, there's a fighting energy. And then ask you a penguin with a huge block of ice head. A funny looking Pokemon. And it has icy snow and block face. Because obviously it's a block. A face of block. Alright, then there's a full face guard. So um, I guess Pokemon is taking Pokemon to the next level and they will go to space. It has, it's a Pokemon tool. It's an item trainer. There's the effect. It's a pretty cool looking hel helmet, I'll say though. Anyways, there's a Hypno trying to hypnotize you. To go to him and do things to you that you don't agree with has hypnosis and wake up slap it will slap you after he has he's been done with you with whatever he does to you look at his face it's very menacing very hypnotic you will get hypnotized and come to said direction uh, address anyways then there's a uh, Reggie Drago, that's how you call him. They're uh, one of the Reggies. He's, um, I don't know how new he is, 2021 potentially, but he's, uh, yeah, he's one of the new Reggies, along with the electric one. There's the dragon version, which actually looks pretty cool. Reminds me of someone, I just cannot think of who at the moment, but it kind of looks like a Yu Yu card in a way with the dragon arms as hammer in and dragon energy wait why does it say 240 and a minus symbol what is that supposed to mean this attack does 20 less damage for each damage counter on this pokemon wow okay i don't know how it is played but i'm assuming damage counters are usually good maybe i don't know to be honest but it looks cool though regardless and then there's flapple flapple yeah flapple a very interesting Pokemon. Uh, he evolves from Eplin, who is an apple in disguise of a dragon, older worm, I guess. Then he becomes a, a dragon with the apple still intact. Apple wing Pokemon. It's, uh, it has acidic, 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 maybe acidic mucus. Um, Okay, and then there's a fighting tackle. I was looking if he had some mucus coming out of the nose, but it doesn't seem like it. And there's the rare. Cool. All right, chilling rain. Maybe I saved the best pack for last. At least I hope so. All right, I'm gonna open this pack nicely. 
I'm gonna try my best not to mess it up. There we go. So let's see. Oh, very smooth. That's a nice pack. Came out very nice. Did not get damaged at all. Anyways, I'm gonna leave it right here. All right, here's the code. And now, from five, six, seven, like this. All right, first is Bound Sweet, Bone, Bone Sweet, Bound Sweet, I think. It's a fruit Pokemon and it has splash. How does it have splash? There's no water. Maybe it rained, I don't know. Maybe it has water inside of it. Oh, splash, it's a fruit. So, you know how fruits have um, juice? Potentially, that's how it does splash. That's what I'm assuming. Fur, fur, fro. I've never seen this Pokemon. And I have Sword and Shield. Well, I haven't finished it, to be honest. But I did uh, uh, quite a bit uh, in Sword and Shield. Well, Sword, and that's both of them. I got like at least 40% in the game and I didn't, do not recall seeing this Pokemon at all. Interesting. It's a poodle Pokemon. It's a dog. Find a friend for attack. How about I find you because I have never seen you before. All right. Then there's Diglett. A rapid strike. And it has Dig. Of course it has Dig. All it does is dig. It's Diglett. It even has it in the name. Anyways, um, Larvesto. The little bug Pokemon. Uh, it has Flame Charge. I remember getting him, her. It was a her in my, in my um, Pokemon White game, I think. I had a, got it as an egg from someone. I don't remember who, but I got it from someone. Someone who wanted to get rid of the egg. Anyways, there's a NK. He has a bunch of food. Seems like he's gonna make a meal for himself. There's the fire right there. So what is he? Oh, okay, he's taking it over there. Okay, he has spinning attack. Okay, cool. And there's a leaf energy. Then a Whirlipede. Whirlipede, is that what you call it? Which uh, evolves from Venipede. Has poison sting and rolling tackle. All right, next card is Say Bold, I think. A rapid strike as a supporter trainer. Some guy that I don't recall either. Potentially, I'm assuming he's gonna he's in um, Sword and Shield. Anyways, there's Layron, Layron or Larion. I think it's Layron, right? Right. They are. Um, I used him in Pokemon, which one was it? Sapphire. He's a cool Pokemon, I like him. Especially the last evolution. He has Tackle and Metal Claw. Then there's um, Slurpuff. Slurping on that Puff. You know what I mean? He has the Munchies. That is my clue. And there's a, uh, he has Follow the Scent which is kind of hard to see, and Fairy Wind. Cool. All right, now for the last card. Will be, ooh, I see something. Will be something good. It kind of looks like it. And Metagross VMAX. Ooh, the big version of the big buffy legs. Sap Traction and Max Rush. That's so cool. Is this, um? I don't think it's a full art, right? No, I don't, yeah, I don't think it is. But regardless, it's on VMAX. Evolves from Metacross V, Dynamax. The, the one I already got, it's not a VMAX, right? The other Metacross. Oh, there's one, there we go. There's the Buffy legs, and there's huge Buffy legs, because it's the Mega uh, VMAX version. They're so cool. So I definitely saved saved the last pack for last, just out of design, because I like the design, the colors of the pack. So very cool. Without uh, without knowing it was gonna be the 
the better pack out of all. The ones you have the better card, I guess. Oh, it's very shiny. I like the rainbow, rainbowy shine with the light. It does have texture. Not, not as much. It's kind of just like certain parts. I kind of did feel it when I was um, uh, putting it in the back, but I wasn't able to uh, tell properly. But yeah, there's the VMAX Metacross. Very cool. That's 330, yeah, 330 HP. And yeah, so um, this is steel energy, right? Steel monster, I mean steel Pokemon. Very, very nice card. Anyways, that is it. And now for Garfield's 2023 calendar segment. There's the segment where I continue showing the comic strip from the day I left off, which was on the, um, what day was it? The 9th. So April 5th, 6th, 7th. Oh, that's the continuing day. So I left off here on the 8th and 9th of April. And now to continue with the next date, which is April 10th. On a Monday, Easter Monday, Australia, Canada, Ireland, NZ, UK, except Scotland. I guess Scotland doesn't like Easter or doesn't like the bunny rabbits with the eggs. Anyways, um, let's see. So there's Garfield and Odie. Odie is uh, accelerating like usual. Then there's John, not impressed with both of them. Then look, Odie, <laughs> he points, his ears go up. He's very excited. The tail is now wagging though. And then uh, John looks concerned with whatever um, Garfield is pointing at. And oh, he got very excited. He turned and his tongue got uh, wrapped around John <laughs> in the John is still very concerned and surprised and Garfield satisfied with what he did. I love how he they have huge feet. I don't know, just funny. Anyways, next comic strip. April 11th on a Tuesday, no special date. Here's when mom was on her knitting um, binge. So he's showing Garfield a book of his mom, or John's mom, knitting, I guess, knitting bench. She knitted sweaters for everyone in the family. Nobody likes knitted sweaters too much. And then for the chickens, the rhinestones are a bit much. That is funny. He, she knitted, knitted some sweaters for the chickens as well. I actually would like to see a chicken with knitted sweaters. They would look very cute. Anyways, there's a uh, April 12th on Wednesday, no special date. For you, Liz, I would climb the highest mount mountain. And he looks like uh, he's very serious. Although it does sound scary and now he is not serious and she looks surprised. Please don't make me. <laughs> now he's on. Uh, scared that she's gonna get him to do it oh go ahead and Garfield is encouraging her <laughs> it makes it seem like they're, they're literally uh, close to a mountain which it could be potentially anyways next day April 13 Thursday Passover ends I'm not sure what that is but okay bark 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 it's a huge dog with glasses. Not sure why he has glasses. You don't seem as tough with those glasses on. So, um, he looks like he's listening to what Garfield said and he's about to do something about it. Oh, boo hoo. I'm sorry. Oh, boo hoo. Wait, what? Oh, he's crying over it? Oh, wow. I was actually expecting him to go back, take them off, and then scare Garfield. <laughs> and now Garfield is like, I'm sorry for making you cry. 
Of course, cats are the superior animal and the more tougher than dogs. All right, then there's um, today's date, April 14th. Holy Friday, Orthodox. There's the special date. Okay, so Garfield looks very... Um, how do you say the word? Lu lunatic. Lunatic. Crazy. Insane. Is that coffee too strong? Oh, okay. No. <laughs> yeah, he's very insane. And they scared John to... Um, his. He um, fell uh, out of his shoes. You see his socks. Which don't look properly on with these little things hanging from the from the end. But yeah, very insane looking Garfield. His ears even came off. Cause that how that's how crazy he is over the coffee. Very hyper basically. And that is it for today's date for the Garfield's comic strips. And that is it for Pokemon as well. Very cool opening. Um, last pack was the best, of course. And yeah, I'll continue on to the next opening, whichever it is, on uh, whatever date. But for now, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you liked the video. Comment down below what you guys think. And I'll see you guys in the next Pokemon opening video.